Yeah, fantasy on my phone Yeah, hit it from the back, watch a nigga bless you Yeah, crying in my arms like a nigga wrecked you Hey guys, Armand Knox here and in today's video I'm gonna show you guys a ray effect that I used on one of my previous edits so let's get into this first you go into video store and split the scenes where you want the rays so I'll do it on the slow motion part right there edit split the scenes I don't want the rays for the whole time, so I'll put like up to there. Split it. Then click re-effect clip. And then just slide to the right. And then, okay, no, not color. You go to the paintbrush on this, the top or the side. Then you go to focus. Right here, and pick not the middle one, the one, the, the middle at the bottom, bottom row, and then just keep layering it. So make like five layers. No, probably more than five. So you just keep clicking new, re effect clip, and then quick effects. Try to do it quick for you guys. Again. Okay, now you go to multi layer, multi layer clip. So the first, well, the back should be the one you started off with. So I started my blurring on the bottom. So the first one is on the top right. So I'll click that one that's plain with the filter and then. The last ones with all the, so you can see the difference, and then click next, click none, click next, click the one, and then you see the opacity, opacity. I don't know what the fuck you call it, and uh, just turn it down, and then fade it in. So like, keep it like that much. And then at the end, just start fading it out. Just fade it to like 20. I fade it to zero because it's gonna fade to zero again. I could turn it up more if you want. And then, so you can leave it like that. If you just want simple, if you want it simple, just leave it like that. If you want to add more. Slide along this, the bottom. Click color shift. Right here, you can just turn it up. So right here. So I turned it up all the way, so you just turn it lower. Like how you want it. So I'll just put it like that. Yeah. Go back. Not back. Click the one, and then if you want to move it, so if you don't, if you don't want the rays like right along with it, you can just move the screen. So like the effect moves with the guy. So you just move it back to fade it away from him a bit. So I'll fade it back. So, yeah, that's probably all I'm going to do for this edit, and that's how I make my array effects, and just click here, click create, then create yes, and then process, measures. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial, and I'll make more for you guys. If you, yeah.
Whenever I make an edit on Nuxtart Edits, just tell me if you want a tutorial on it and I'll make it. Thanks for watching and I'm out. Peace.